Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and welcome to episode 4 of Psychonauts 2, one of Hippie's personal favorites on the first play. And this is the second play. How's everyone doing? Hello, Najuni. Good to see you. Sash, love. I'm going as fast as I can. This is as fast as I can start the stream. Well, today. Some other days it could be faster. All right. We're doing something important. We're... We're reassembling Ford Crawler. More accurately, we're <laughs> we're reassembling uh, Ford's psyche. Lost aspects of Ford's mind. Let's put it that way. And we got lost here. This is where this is. So the last episode was supposed to be one of the, th I think, three levels that it takes to re reassemble Ford. Nah. Pfft. What was I doing? I was running around the questionable area, and I'm still gonna do that. It's darn fun, but we're gonna get to four definitely. It'll help us, I promise. It'll be, it'll make things easier. One, well, it's easing up on that 100%, uh, and uh, two, well, we'll get in there stronger. The levels are just gonna be breezy. This is like an RPG almost. It's not an RPG. It's a, it's a platformer through and through. But it kind of works as an RPG, like an RPG in in the sense that you just grind a little. And then you go in there and slap everyone and take names and whatever else you want because you're the big man and they can't really fight back. <laughs> so there were more cards here, I'm pretty sure. This is where where Dad is. Oh my god, that music. Just hearing this music, I could stay here all day, even after I do everything. It's just, they made it beautiful. Look at this. Oh, look, there's a deer. Oh, well, let's check the powers so I don't uh, end up cooking it. All right. You don't have fleas, do you? It doesn't matter if you're petting it <laughs> telepathically, but okay, telepathically, I meant more like, you know what I meant. What's the word? Psychically, I guess. Can I make it there? Oh, nope. So close. Zip. That change of controls from the first to second game, I guess I get what they were doing, but it's a little confusing if you're playing them one after another. Because in the first game, uh, levitation was fixed to RB or L1. I'm sorry, LB or L1. But in the second game, yeah, levitation was fixed to L1 or LB, and uh, floating would always be the left trigger or L2, right? But in this game, it's whatever you set it on, and floating and levitation are gonna be the same number, same button. And that tends to fuck me over. Because I've gotten... I, I got out fresh from Psychonauts 1. Hello, Sister Ljubka! Zdravo Ljubče! Šta ima? I'm... I'm... Okay, I mean, ah, oh, I'm coming. coming. Yeah, I, I thought she was going to say something. As as I, remember it. <laughs> I thought it was going to be something useful and constructive. <laughs> I'm, I'm what? I'm what? Zelda's my what? No, don't fall, you bastard. Oh, he fell. Well, definitely can't fly forever like in the first game. That's another... That's another thing I'll miss. Did we go up to funicular? We did. What is left in the questionable area? What's up, Lyubka? How's your days going? How's your work going? Your, like, your insane shifts, are they gone? <laughs> I had to get... Um, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good thinking. Quick thinking. Do we have extend duration of your brain, blo brain block? <laughs> brain block. But we put Beast Mastery, so... So we can pet the forest life. Can we go up to funicular? I forgot what was was there anything. Man, up? 
Uh, well, that's a good question. Is it up? Because it's so slow, I am losing. I'm losing sense of direction here. Whee! Look at me rolling on my own ball. <laughs> there we go. Ah, uh, let him. He likes the funicular. Just let him have his fun. I know it's a virtual character, but just hearing his happiness makes me happy. <laughs> oh shit! Is it like longer shifts now because of the holiday work and everything that's happening? I wish you a good rest, sister. <laughs> this banter from Raz, that's what I want. Questionable gifts. Oh, yeah, we've been here. There's a gift shop. And there's the sister. The nut, Lupka. <laughs> um, fair ones. Do we have that? Meow. Oh, I'm just a spoiled kid. Too. Well, younger brother. What can you do? This is what she sees me as. All right. Hey, Frazy. I can't believe Mom forgave you so easily. Bye, Frazy. Later, trader. Oh, mid shift. Well, I don't know if that's worse than the second shift. Honestly, sometimes I think it is. Like your whole day is gone. What is this? You're coming home at like six thirty, and you left at like noon. So, unless you wake up at the crack of dawn, at the ass crack of dawn, at <laughs> five a.m. or something, your day's kind of wasted. But hey, you don't need me to remind you of that. <laughs> I'm sure. See, it's just enjoyable to exist here. I don't even have to do shit. I could just run around here for hours, probably. That's the adventure. That's a that's a sign of a good adventure game. But if you've ever seen Project Spark, tell me you're not having some uh, Project Spark flashbacks. You know, I wouldn't be surprised. I don't know which engine this is. Actually, oh yeah, it's Unreal. Yep. That says they're Unreal. <laughs> of course, they're always so proud of their Unreal Engine. Them epic games and whatnot. Yeah, we've been all the way up here. It's the burnt down uh, gift shop. It just I like enjoying this. Wait, what about that little? Yeah, I'm gonna check that. I I, I don't know if there's anything up there on that little mountain. Yeah, accidental acrobatics. Huh, depth perception. <laughs> Just coming from here, it looked like it was the same. <laughs> so up there, see where that crow thing is? I can't, I can't look that high. What about the chimney? The chimney won't do shit, I'm sure. What about that crow? It just sees me as a monster. <laughs> look at me, hunting from the grass. <laughs> yeah, hippie's having fun with himself. Don't even need friends. Who needs friends? Who needs friends when you got imagination? Go away, crow. It's my house now. Go, get. <laughs> I wonder if... I can't remember, but... You know, I sure hope there's going to be a longer levitation balloon power, because... I, I need that. Wait, what am I even doing here? I'm just having fun. Sure, that's allowed. But what is there to collect? Six more cards. Woohoo! Three chests, but I got all the keys. And two more side challenge markers. Well, there's still six more cards, right? They should be easy to spot. You just look around the forest and see where they're flying. They're always... They're never steady, you know. They, they give themselves away. This is such a misunderstanding of Citanium, I can't even bear to read it. This is such a misunderstanding <laughs> of Citanium, I can't even bear to read it. Is that a person down there? That looks like a person. That's not a, No, that's a flower. I was wondering for a second. Nope, definitely. Is it though? Hi there. 
Nope, that's a flower. Alright. Well, you know, I had to check. Does it burn? Nope. So, not interesting. I think I need to look somewhere even damper. Oh, he's talking about the mushrooms the entire time. And like, first time I played it, I didn't even get that quest. I came, I did all this. I never found Lily's secret place where she exercises her darkest thoughts. I think that's what he called it. Nope. Just flew by it. Found everything else. That was the... I was missing one achievement and one quest at the end of the game, and that's how I found out about it. Oh, there's more here. Did we read this? Oh. I find all these facts questionable. <laughs> yeah, I remember this. Okay, so this this will be useful in the future. For now, let's try not to die and just gently jump down there. Oh, hi, goat. They won't bite. If you time it, the, the the levitation will last, but still, it's such a waste. I feel it was much more fun. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a card. So I haven't checked that part at all, almost. I've been to, through the entire campfire. I've climbed these trees, falls, campground. Everything's a question. It just bugs me out. There's Dad still trying. Oh, there's one of the squirrels. Let's see if... They've been traumatized by the bulls. Oh, oh my! That's my head. How embarrassing! What did he do? Did he set his head on fire? Anyone can burn a pine cone, but to set your own head on fire—that takes a sharp third eye. If you know what I mean. I, I, I see. Third eye. <laughs> what a little troll! You're trolling my dad. What's her face? Hand him over. Norma. Can I have my clothes back yet, kid? You got a long way to go. Better get moving. Yeah, that's how you end up with different clothes. She still thinks I'm a mole. And maybe because that maybe that's why she's good with my dad. She's actually Dad? Hi, son. Trying to get info I'm from him. Any better at this? I'll let you get back to practicing. Yes, yes. I think I'm almost there. Well, after after setting your head on fire. Oh, I'm the little Am I doing this right? Flea circus. Maybe Master. you can give me a few pointers afterward. Alright, stop, stop sucking up to my dad, please. It's creepy. Well, where were we here? I've been there, I've been there. I think I've been to all, both of those. Nope. Come on. You think you can grab it? Oh. Ooh, so Just barely it. enough. So I've been everywhere here, I'm pretty sure. And the other one would have taken me up there, and the draft over there. Yeah, I've been there, done that. I don't see any flopping cards, so that tells me I've done everything I could here. How about here? No! Oh, shit. <laughs> Sounded like he was talking to me. Come on, son, you broke your fucking shit in front of a girl here. What's wrong with you? Get up and try again. <laughs> like the sounds of him arguing with the with the pine cone. <laughs> Capricious conifer. I don't see anything there or there. There? I could go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That looks like. Did I do that one? Let's find out, huh? Oh, if I push, if I pull this, it'll just lower me down, will it? Yep. I'm gonna fall for that one again. Because I did several times last time. Last Thursday. She's slacking off with what? Hmm. Maybe if I do this right... I, I forgot how to climb there, but I'm pretty sure there's always multiple... Ways to solve an issue here. Come on. Whoop, don't fall. There you go. And then... Uh, will this work? Let's find out. I doubt it, but you know what? Yup, 
Well, I tried. Oof, that hurt. Alright, I think it's better just to fly here, there naturally. But which was it? Which... I think it was this one, actually. Just climb up. My, f my first instinct was right. Whoop. Yep, and then just use the branches. There you go. And then fly using the fly thingy. And then we, we were here. Alright, alright. So there's one in the underground, according to the quest, right? Critical missions. Well, look, look how this fourth quest turned into two, four, eight quests. Scavenger hunt, la da 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 da. Queepy is all around. Underground, underground in the questionable area. All right, we'll find that. Hiya! Oh, you can only do it twice. Doesn't matter how good you are at spacing it. Interestingly, this whole camp area was set up like for circus kids. As if they knew. So around here, diner, all right, we've been there. Warning, the forgetful forest is not part of the questionable area recreation center and is not covered by our insurance policy. This sounds like the best attraction in the questionable area to me. Can't go there yet. There's nothing there for us. Wait, wait. somewhere here. Well, let's look around. I'm pretty sure there was a cave. Did I open that cave? Well, I opened a cave. There was a cave opening. Was it the right cave? Who knows? Let's find out. Oh, is she now? What, this? Really? Aha! Good! Fuck. Is this some does this count as underground? No first person, that really bothers me. I can't go first person and I miss that a lot. First person is good when you wanna look around. It, looking around in the third person is shit. Most games, you know, depends. There are There are, what do you call those when they're special? special? Um, not consequences. Well, I'm in my word stuck brain help mode. Uh, what do we need? Well, we need most everything, almost. Don't need that. Exceptions, exceptions. I was looking for the word exceptions. Oh, that was a lot harder than normally. That looks like a face, creepy little face. It, it's not. That's the good thing. Alrighty, then let's go to the part of the forest we haven't been to, which is... Hi, squirrel. No secrets, huh? Well, it would show secret sign if there were secrets here. Is that a? Does that not hold a Psychonaut log logo? That rusty van. Oh my God, it does. Did they forget about it here? Yeah, there was a cave here. I think we opened the one. There it is. Nope, we haven't opened it. Why didn't I not open it? And the chest. 
Good find. I thought I opened this game. I probably wanted to and got distracted by something else. Alright, so that's two more cards. Uh, how do you check, what was it, the map? Yeah, map, and then, yeah, there you go. Two more chests, four more cards left, and two side markers. And we're still not in the part of the forest that I actually want to uh, go through. Nothing here. We yep. I love that, you know, final jump after the rail. It's muy bien. I think we were here, but we're gonna check. We've been there. How about this? Boom. Oh. And we've been there, I'm pretty sure we've climbed all the way. After setting up the tent. Before setting it up, and after setting it up. Oh, there's the road. We can... Can we even get... No, we can never get there. That's right. So that's where... Check car for squirrels. <laughs> so that one goes towards the mother lobe over there. That's where the... Where the gate guy is. And that's the road coming in. Interesting. All right. I, I didn't notice this until now, honestly. <laughs> Nothing here. What about that shack? I've been I've been in there because that's nearby where the family is. Let's go that way. I, I know where some cards are over there. Oh boy. All right. Here we go. Here goes nothing. Hiya! Good. No legs were broken today. You found Bucky Fierro's questionable area. Who the fuck is Bucky Fierro? The dude who found the questionable area? Question? Haunted water wheel. Well, this is where he was like. My family has already started the marketing. That's the haunted water wheel and the upside down. So it's all effects of the Citanium, right? But, you know, simple people didn't know if they thought it was magical or something. Oh, so we can use that to jump over. Let's do it. Uh, find a different approach, right? For everything. That's my philosophy. Until, you know, it hurts. Then I'll be like, ah, I want to go to the thing I know. <laughs> to the familiar thing. Are you real? What's your opinion on no kill traps? <laughs> but they're real. Well, that's beautiful, isn't it? Just goes into water. If I had the magnet, if I had the magnet, it would be easier. Okay, so that's if I want to come back there. There's a car right there. There's the beaver. Hi, beaver. From the Want to hear street. about the day I've had? No? Okay. No. Yeah. Can you even go here? Uh, it looks like you can. Yeah, we need... That's for later. Still need a certain power to make that useful that and the wheel here along with the item on the top it's closed nobody's here so wait wait what about the horseshoe So do I have to throw it from beyond this? Well, instant miracle. Opening this spring, cave of... Sa oh yeah, there's a cave. The whole cave I didn't explore, that's right. Hang in there, Ford, I'm coming to save you, all leveled up and whatnot. 
scoreboard. He's crazier than ever now, waiting for us. Aquato. Alright, that's the family. Oh. I'm sitting as if I'm expecting to jump up any second. That's not relaxed. Rules. What? There oh. are no rules in horseshoes. <coughs> Just the shoe, the stake, and your mind. Well, that's when you're throwing it with mine. What about us regular folk? Oh yeah! Nice, thank you, squirrel. Are they hoarding titanium? Is that what's happening here? No, no, no wonder Dogen thinks they want to kill him. They're liars. <laughs> so, but they weren't liars. They were telling the truth, were they? Just it was so ridiculous. Nobody, no one would believe them. You don't bite, right? You don't have rabies, do you? I think that's one of the things here. Hi there. Okay, I hear Queepy. There's Queepy. Alright, that's something. Goes towards another quest. Hmm. All three of them, please. Whoop. Exactly what I need. Nice. Can I burn our equipment? Oh, there's another cave. Yeah, this is the. This is where I said. Why I said I know where some other cards are. Still up there as well. Uh, this is from memory. This is just purely from memory. Uh, why didn't you turn? I guess he gets stuck. There it is. That's the one. Alright. Alright, let's prepare the powers. That, that. That, yeah, that'll do good. That'll do good. I could put some mental connection, but it'll be a, yeah, it's gonna be enough. Maybe this will be the easiest. Oh no, it feels worse. This one looks tough. What is that? It's a, oh, it's the big guy. Oh, they, they throw things now? Take a big blast. <laughs> Alright, only two health left. I should be careful. What's the grab? LB, alright. There you go. <laughs> wow, it's hard to dodge that. Push. That works. Keep throwing in my way. It's one less. All right. All right. Leave me one more. All right. I'll, I'll have two grenades now. For the big guy, I knew it. If something like that's happening, that means these guys are... Oh. How do I focus? That's right. Oh shit, I need my... Ah! Fuck, I didn't need my mental pop. I was like, ah, I'll get it later. That's okay, that's okay. Did I win? Oh, that's right. I got destroyed. <laughs> I guess I should try again. All right, full health. So, wait, that means I saved my pop. I saved my pop. All right, good. <laughs> Let's go back in there. Last one. <laughs> Maybe this will be the easiest. Uh -oh. 
This one looks tough. No, not for them. I gotta lock on. There you go. That's right. Don't lock on now. Whoop. That's how you outrun them. Alright. Oops. They also dodge. Now gonna need the... Uh, Grenade boys, please. Oh, jeez, he's not playing. One more, please. Grenade. Oh, shit. Okay, two grenades. I can live with that. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Trying to save as many grenades as possible for the big guys. That was two by one. All right, not the way I planned. Not the way I planned. There you go, the suiciders. Woohoo! Dead? Oh, okay. I expected a boss or something. Phew. That's all of them. I should let Gisu know I got it done. And maybe punch her in the arm. So that's done. Return to Gisu. Alright. Oh, and it refreshed all the titanium because I died. Isn't that beautiful? 591. So we'll have we'll get to 1,000 very fast. We don't need 1,000. We need 800 something, wasn't it? For the for the magnet, I want the magnet, and I want. Stay out the water. Hi, Nona. Well, I gotta go back to my spy stuff. Good boy. Now don't get that big head. Oh, she's not saying, stay out of the water. That's one of the things he always says. Stay out of the water. What do we have here? Uh, clairvoyance. And here, that. And then here, we're gonna put that. So I don't kill any animals. So, it was like this. Wait. This way? No, that way? That way, I think. And then going up, 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 and up. I think. Oh, I see a chest. I don't know if... No, I, I think I opened that one, actually. Would it be there if I opened it? That's a good question. This will just lower me straight down to that platform, which, I mean, it's not that bad. I just expected more cards here, you know, something, anything. Am I missing something? I, maybe not. Fuck it, I'll just, I'll listen to, I'll listen to my elders. There you go. There's that one. That's not bad, that's quite a lot of stuff. Oh yeah, I hear him up there on the platform. Let's a real Yeti in here or I want my money back. I <laughs> he didn't put any money in it. I'm gonna go in there anyway. The cave of Sasalakapas. Sasalakapas. There should be an exhibit here, yeah, there should be oh. journal in the leaves conclusive proof sasclops is real self-portrait petrified droppings journal 
Hmm. I want to believe in Sasclops, but you're not making it easy, guys. <laughs> That's a healthy uh, young mind. What if I burn the old Sasclops stuff? Why is there a fucking electrical outlet here? Does the Sasclops use electricity? Well, Can of corn. The expiration date on this thing is the year I was born. <laughs> How many do we have? The value of this mysterious artifact lies not in its nutritive content, but in its significance to the older generation of psychonauts. We suspect it contains more secrets than corn. <laughs> uh, expiration date was the year he was born, right? Wait, how many more cards? Two more cards. Two more chests. Two more markers. Two, two, two. All right. Well, there's water. Ah, I remember. I gotta use my acrobatic. <laughs> That's such a disrespect to a fossil. Got a side card. Sasclops versus Nessie. Who would win? Claws. Sasclops. Claw. Claws. Oppos opposable thumbs. Possible psychic powers. Single eye gives focus. What about depth perception? <laughs> Nessie, larger, swims, bigger teeth, more established fan base. Because <laughs> that's that's definitely what's gonna have them. The fan base. Uh, fire, there. Oh shit, I could have read it. Fuck. Yeah, please. Nessie would totally win because Nessie is real. Yep. Man, it's uh, the saddest thing is interrupting a good comment because you pressed the button. Yeah, I'll take that. Wait, really? That's that can be true, can it? I was just there. I was just checking it. Oh, look, all the cards. All right. Well, that means two more supply chests and two more side challenge markers, and one of them is right here. So Nessie is real. That's the takeaway. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. Let's walk the rope instead of hanging off from it. Rank up. We got two stars now, huh? Anything we need to know? Three, three. Levitation is maxed out. Nothing to do there. Melee is maxed out. So next thing... Well, when we have three stars, we'll think about it. Three. Um, I'm sorry, they're not stars. They're... Ooh, they're... Something points. Bonus school points. I don't know, man. I'm not a school kid. Or a psychonaut um, intern. Intern points. Is that what they're called? There's the exit. See you next time. Well, that's not really much of an exhibit, is it? This is supposed to be like the Sasclops' lair, huh? I'm starting to see why this questionable area went out of business. This is Morris Martinez, and you're listening to KLOB. We probe the mother load. What are you listening to? He just said. Local radio station. I have no idea where it's coming from, but I love it. Oh, can I listen to it with you? No! <laughs> Alright, little brother. If you're gonna be a little brother, then stay a little brother. What can I do? Let's go a little to the left. Kitty? Oh, I could smell you. She yawned in my direction. Yep, welcome, kitty. Don't even ask you. I just climbed the fucking table. <laughs> she wanted to be here, so she just climbed. Whatever. <laughs> table. Legs. 
me. Who cares? Well, I just fed her. She, she's happy. She's a happy cat. Yes, you are, you little fat so. Look at that chubby ass. She's not chubby. She's actually pretty healthy. I wouldn't let you go chubby, would I? Because that means you get heart disease. Alright. Are you happy with the Psychonauts, kitty? Ah, there's the chest. Snap your fingers. Trump, who's the boss, boss. So, anything else left here? Oh my god, you don't have to breathe this way, just sleep. Without exu exhuming too much. You know what I mean, kitty? Why is that there? Where could I go? I guess I could climb from there? Yeah, I guess that's why it's there. Ah! I was gonna, sh I was gonna show something, but then I fell. <laughs> Maybe from here? Yeah, something like that, I would imagine. Hi. Do you know Harold? Harold's a rat, and that's a rabbit. They, they're not relatives or anything. 904 Titanium. Alright, and we have enough to buy more shit. So, I got all the cards from here, right? That's what they said. I got... One more chest and two, one more side challenge marker. And I'm gonna bet my ass that both of them are gonna end up being up on that waterfall. Which, or in, there's my, there might be a cave in the waterfall. So for now, I'll just, I'll give up. But I haven't forgotten about it. I'm, I won't give up. I'm just gonna do some other shit. There's the whole scavenger thingy, scavenger hunt. Water wheel? Oh, that's where it is. It goes. What makes it go, nobody knows. Uh, it's water, dummies. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like there's something there. Or maybe just textures aligning or something. Particles particling. Oh. Accidentally found creepy again. There's a lot in the, in, you know, behind the scenes, so to speak. It's not just the main path. You actually have to go off path to see everything. So where is he? Up in the tree? Yeah, he's up in the tree. All right, how do we climb that tree? All right, creepy. Since since I found you, bro. I didn't mean to, but wait, from where? From there? There's the tickets. He's up there. Alright, how did I get up there the first time? I climbed all through the, those trees. Yeah, okay, I remember. I went up those trees. And when you fuck up, you fall down. I remember that much. You don't have to double do the ju double jump all the time. That's just me. I don't know why I'm doing that. That's uh, too much Crash Bandicoot and other platformers with double jumping. So what do we say for this? <laughs> Climb. I don't know why that one's harder than most. Alright, uh, Quippy. I just want to dance with you. I no. need my me time. <laughs> He's gone again. Alright, how many times you gotta find Quippy? Six. Ooh. Alright. Just listen for the music. Yep. It's very hard to miss him. Yeah, we got that. I forgot I got that. Maybe I should have started that quest earlier. Zoop. Just listen to Welcome to My Mind. Know where any good 
animal parties are? <laughs> yep, there he is. Man, bro, you're you gotta find something better than music because it's too easy to find you this way. Do you play Game Boy with headset or listen to the music with headset on? Anything is better than nothing. Shoot, bird, I'm looking for my younger brother. Da, da, ba, ba, da. Mom's really worried about me. Oh, please. I'm the only one she doesn't need to worry about. You know, I could just grab him, being the older brother in this situation, and fairly stronger, I imagine. But no, I want to be the good brother. Can I go down without dying? You know what? I sure as hell can try. Woo! That'll work. I'll listen for the radio. The sound of him running on that psychic ball sounds like running on a balloon with the squeaking and all. Oh yeah, the toilets. Is he gonna react to them again? You can flush them all, huh? No, just the first time. Never enough nicks. Oh, that's... Is that subliminal messaging for what we're about to do? No, only the first time he reacts. He goes, oh my god, this one's even worse. I they call me the Flashinator. <laughs> oh, you can you can actually enter. Ah, don't 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 do the wall thing. Yeah, that thing. Don't do that. No, you can't. It's made so you can't jump between them. All right. Maybe up the funicular. Don't get... Oh, you can grind that thing. Good. Just don't get killed by the incoming funicular. <laughs> It'll be the funniest death since that guy... See, that guy was uh, run over by a... Uh, was it a steamroller? What was it? Zamboni and uh, Austin Powers. <laughs> How'd you die, boy? Oh, I got run over by a funicular. Hey, take skill. Hi, neighbor. It's probably, you know... It's probably a lot faster, you know, and bigger in scope in reality <laughs> than just in a video game like this. Distance doesn't mean much. Have you seen Creepy? Oh, Creepy. Well, he's not here. Whatever's up there, we can't see it, so... been in there I'm pretty sure have, have I no. wait, wait that's that's the exit from maybe from the waterfall well it is the exit from something 
I'm gonna guess it's from the waterfall up there. Once you do what you have in the cave, you exit by sliding out here. So I'm not gonna push trying to find what the hell is on the other side. listening for Queepy's punk, whatever that is. So that one's sweetie. Oh, if only Mirtala were taller. There's a bunny. Oh, you can't, you can't, almost, almost outside, but not really. I don't hear him. Or somewhere. Not there. Well, sh you know what? Why not there? He's gonna be loud enough to be heard. Could be at the entrance though. Because we found him here already. I doubt he'll be close by all creepy who shit there's a long way down boing I'm gonna go somewhere near the entrance Just listen. He'll give himself away with sound. Sounds like the music is changing every five seconds. Been there. Huh. So much faster this way anyway. No, oh, he might be on the restaurant. Yep. Yep, called it. Oh. There he is. That's five out of six, right? That song is pretty cool. It is cool. Oh, you can see exactly which pins he has. That's beautiful, isn't it? There's the main gate. That's at 1,000, I'm sure. Oh wait, we can have 5,000 now. I forgot I bought the other expansion. Good. So keep piling it up. Go through the whole park once again. about back home <laughs> nice wow memory is a wonderful thing there he is I think I know who's broadcasting that station. I mean, we've been there. Why do you need to take over everything I like? Haha! <laughs> -ha. Oh, there you go. Completed. Now we got three of them. 
All right, what's going up first? Telekinesis, sleight of hand. Cooldowns between TK plucks are shortened. That's good. And swift lift is going to be useful, especially for battles when plucking those grenades. Psy Blast, Mind Mag, gain an additional blast before having to recharge. Useful, but I'm not really using Psy Blast so much right now. Pyrokinesis, Slow Cooker. I've been eyeing that one since the start. I think I'm going to go with, the, with that one. Clairvoyance. Take no damage for a brief period when entering Clairvoyance. So Clairvoyance final upgrade affects all the Psy powers. No cooldowns, infinite. Like in the first game, you get infinite ammo at one point. Only the first game was more like... It was more similar to the early 90s. Well, the 90s 3D platformers. It was something between... It was something like... Literally like it continued Banjo-Kazooie and DK64 with the way things went, the collectibles, the upgrades, all that. But in the second game, it's more... Here it's more... Let's say, I don't know, modernized, I guess modernized, because this is how things work now. I'm not going to upgrade anything, by the way, I just saw there, I didn't get the Dark Thoughts upgrade, so we're going to get that first. Oh, I hear that old chopper coming. Hello, hello Raiders! Thank you for the raid, Sexy Wesky. Hello and welcome everyone. Welcome to Psychonauts 2. How you doing, Wesky? How's everyone doing? Alright, we can go from here, right? I could use the fast travel. Thank you, Lupka. Ready or not, what was that? That was like a co-op game, wasn't it? Pong. Straight out of there. <laughs> I love the goats. The goats are ridiculous. How are you doing, my friend Wesker? My friend Wesker. I shouldn't say that in Raccoon City. My friend Wesker gets you killed. <laughs> We've been there, right? Can I fly over there? Just easy does it. You can do it. Come on. Oh, yeah. I can fly anywhere. I'm a free psychic kid. No, I forgot. Cool down. Okay, good. Whew, almost fucked myself over. My stream's going great, man. How's yours? What was ready or not? Uh, remind me. I remember. I think it was a Cove game you played with Kuhn one time. I think we'll be able to fly. Whee! I feel like I'm in a Disney movie. Oh, I, I think I think it is. It has a co-op, doesn't it? SWAT. You were you were rescuing some hostages and telling them to be quieter because you're trying to help them. I think all that's left is auto, and then we'll go to psycho isolation to see Compton Bull. But before we do that, I really go, gotta go and level up, level these up a little. We're gonna go into Bull's brain, and Bull's brain is well. He is Dogen's grandfather, was he? Uh, Atrium. Zoop. Yes, that's the one. That's the one. That looks pretty interesting. I watched you play that a couple times. The the I like games with that you know co-op element where. You can help each other, but you can also fuck each other over, you know what I mean? <laughs> I remember I was confused because your guy kept saying the hostage, Shut up! Shut up! You're gonna give us away! Shut up! Are you rescuing them or are you... Are you uh, hurting them? <laughs> Be a rank riser, a card miser, brand new mental connection. 
Combine. How many do we have? Oh shit, I have no markers. Alright, that's why we're doing this. First things first. First things what what's first, me? Pins. Kill or get suspects. Yeah, that's the one. What was I gonna see? Something useful. Magnet. Mental magnet. Yes, don't don't leave home without this. So definitely buying this one and equip right away instead of instead of beast mastery, I guess. So can't pet animals, don't try, it'll kill them. Wise choice. Alright, what was the other one? Glass cannon, become Jim Chapman, huh? Oh yeah, the 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 discounts, but this doesn't this doesn't pay off until rank 50, which is still 20 ranks away. All right. I guess I could buy some shit now. Hmm, not bad. If you want to stun them, I guess. What's this one? Sensors take more damage from side blasts. I'm going to take this one. It's 500. Fuck it, just... Let's make a rank first before, because I'm gonna spend the money and just ruin everything. Uh, one, two, four, five. There you go, five right away. How many do we have? Only sixteen. All right. That's one rank. Need two more cards for another one, right? So that leaves me with seven hundred ninety-six. Psychic money. What can you buy with that currency? What was I gonna buy? I was gonna buy sensory overload. That's right. 500. Fuck it. Hmm. Alrighty, Wesky. Well, thanks for... Thank you so much for... Um, for rating there, Wesky. Let me give you... Wesker... You have a good night, my friend. I'll see you around this week, I'm sure, yeah. Good night, Wesky. Hi there. Hello, TVNDRA. Tivindra. Hello, Tivindra. Speedrun. It's a weird game for speedrunning, is it? Because it's kind of like, what well, if you speedrun it, you make it harder as well, do you? Interesting, though. I'd love to see that. Are you a Psychonauts fan in general? So what was I, what was I gonna buy? I'm, I'm kind of cheap. I'm thinking, buy, fuck, I'll get money. Explode when you take him out with pyrokinesis. So that's good to use them against their enemies. I want to do different than I did last time. So let's say I'm looking at this, which means I want it. I buy. Intern, staff member, visitor, or intruder of great taste. <laughs> or intruder. Nice, yeah, it's... Don't be a stranger. I was just saying a couple minutes ago how, uh, how it's a great game for, you know, pretty much anyone's taste, you know. Uh, the pins right there, the, the, what they changed from the first game, the pins just make it... I, my first run, I've been play, I was playing it in one way. Now I want to play it in a different way with different perks, let's say, because that's what pins are basically. And uh, you get a, almost a different game. You have. How fast can you finish it? Hey, has anyone seen Sherry? Hey, kid. Definitely. So from like from just from the top of my mind, basically. Uh, The first game just seems easier to speedrun, doesn't it? Or at least it just seems shorter. The This one spreads out a lot more. The main goal is straight, still you could go straight line forward. forward. But the questionable area... I spent the whole, the, the whole last episode Thursday, three hours in questionable area. And now... A full hour again. Just enjoying collecting shit. That's with tricks, right? 30 minutes, I assume. I'm a speedrunning... Uh... 
What's the word when you don't when you suck at something and you don't know anything about this? It's Greek to me. <laughs> but yeah, I understand, but uh, but I've never done it myself. Really, the only game I've come close to speedrunning was Resident Evil Outbreak. So, and maybe Zelda: Link's Awakening. But uh, thirty minutes, please tell me how. <laughs> How do you finish Psychonauts 1 in 30 minutes? That's... Don't collect anything, just run, run, run. How does that affect the bosses? Well, I guess you get all the level, all the powers you need for every boss in time. Interesting. Where was I gonna go? Truman's Grotto Quarry... Parking Lot Quarry, right? Zoop! Crazy. 30 minutes. You see that, love? Did you see that? We have a person here who finished Psychonauts 1 in 30 minutes. Why is it doing that? Like, after loading? They're talking about me, are they? Who? This guy? How's it going? All clear in this area, if that's what you're asking. No, it wasn't, but sure. Okay, they don't see me as a mole, at least. Where was I gonna go? So today we're going to Compton's Cook-Off. That's what I said. And Compton Bulls in Psycho Isolation, wasn't it? Hi! Hi! Hi. Can you hear me? <laughs> what does he see me as? I said, what's your name? Hello, my name is Question Mark. <laughs> wait, 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 let me guess. Cody? No. Max? <laughs> Hector? <laughs> I didn't do this last time. Finn? Angus? Angus, it's Angus, definitely. Bart? <laughs> Sergio? Pete? Are these names of the crowdfunders? Mike? Rufus? Waldo? <laughs> Sasha, I don't remember this. Milo. I don't think we did this. We just went in and talked to her. Hi! <laughs> Eagle? Eagle? Rock? Rock. Tranquility? <laughs> it's a name. Justice? She's got post-its. Cletus? Saul? I can't say cave. Fester? Cave moon? Robespierre? D'Artagnan? Terrell? Oh wait, that's my name. The tank, really? Because of lack of upgrades? Is that why? Save glitch that skips the whole it's asylum part. Oh, I, I, that's yeah, that's. I expected something Girl, like that to help, huge. you know, with the speed. Is she done? Something about you, I like hoots. Mind if I call you hoots? Is she gonna call me hoots now? Oh, jeez, oh, I've gone too far. I'm just gonna be quiet now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Forgive me, hoots. I don't. Yeah. I like finding this shit on the second, third playthrough. All right, Hoots is ready to report. You done there, lady? Uh, let's talk to her before she goes completely nuts. Hello. <laughs> Finally, I thought you'd never say hi. I tell you, I have been waiting for someone to come visit for a long time. I was starting to think I was invisible. You ever get that feeling? Well, there was this one girl who looked kind of like a blue scarecrow, but she scared me. But you see, nice. <laughs> so did I guess your name? Did you see right? that? It's Raz. <laughs> oh, that was the very next name I was going to say. I swear. So, how long are you committing yourself for? Huh? Four years. Just a few minutes. Committing myself to what? I'm not committing myself to anything. I'm not committing myself to anything. Especially not... Wait, what are we talking about here? 
Take our isolation, silly. We don't commit people anymore without their consent. Unless they're a danger to themselves or others. How many people you got in there? Oh, just Agent Bool right now. Agent Bool. He likes it in there. Keeps him from feeling overwhelmed by all the you-know-what in the woods. Trees? Squirrels? Goats? Trees? Ghosts! Is it ghosts? No, I know what it is. Let's say trees. Trees? Voices. He can't shut them out. Can you believe he even finds me overwhelming? <laughs> why did you why did they put her anyway, on the front I'm desk? Room ready if, for you if you'd like it. Actually, I'm just here to visit Agent Bool. Oh. Well, okay. Just be careful. Don't ask him too many things at once or he'll curl up into a little ball and something might explode. Hi. Yeah, <laughs> she's happy again. All right, yeah, what she said about Bull. So uh, that's uh, the grandfather of Dogen Bull. Let's say Raz's best friend from the first game. Though by the end, most of the kids were his best friend. The hardest part is the meat circles glitch, and you have to change the frames per second through the game. Oh, really? There is, yeah, both games are just oozing with fun i mean it's the uh what's his name oh god not peter mcconnell he's the composer but uh, it's pretty late in the day here and my brain is stuck with uh, uh with nouns the tim schaefer yeah tim schaefer was uh working on monkey island right See, I know, I know what I'm thinking, but her turning it into wor 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 that words is uh, the issue. He was one of the, he was in the Monkey Island team, right? Because they, they also have, they have that kind of humor, rubber chicken with a pulley. <laughs> what was it, rubber chicken with a pulley, something like that? There was longer, I think, rubber chicken with a rope and pulley, something like that. That kind of humor, and it's very, it's very prevalent in the first game, but. They kept it in the second game. I liked it. They didn't shy away from being, you know, from using that. Bulls are animal abusers, right? They didn't censor that or anything. They just, his sister up there in the, in the <laughs> making pancakes. Where'd you get the milk? And she just looks at the bird. <laughs> the goats? Ah, that would have been easier, would it? <laughs> All right, so we got, do we have to touch it, I think? So we can use it. I'll just touch it. Let's go see old... Grandpa Bull. We gotta do one level this session. It would be a shame not to. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Just the colors in this game. My god. Psyking's Sensatorium. It's probably one of the most creative creative levels I've seen in a video game ever. Not just not just uh, platformers, but general. Can't read these things here. Light green fall. Well, we can yeah. listen in. I'm trying to catch because I'm doing like a hundred percent and a story run. Trying to catch as mo more uh, as much story as possible, like that lady at the desk, right? Hmm. Oh, is that Harold? See what you're doing there. Hmm. Oh, you think you're clever, don't you? <laughs> Looks like there's a senior league membership card stuck in this frame. Hey, don't even look at that. It's private. Well, you gotta, you, you gotta do a thing huh? to get to a thing. That's right. Yeah, it is. You know, both Psychonauts games are my favorite games to hundred percent. I can say that confidently it's so fun i don't you know there's like in the first game there's the one figment in black velvetopia that uh, drove me nuts last time and this time again i forgot about it in the second game i think it was one in bob's bottles the banana up the tree <laughs> but you know that's very very few considering how large the game is and how much there is to collect it's just a breeze you know all right let's see Let's introduce you to Harold. Let's start with, I'm a friend of your grandson. Hi, I'm Rasputin. I'm a friend of your grandson. Oh, no. 
He hasn't hurt anybody else, has he? No humans that I know of. Good. <laughs> Good. The day I bought the game, I played it 10 hours straight. Yeah, that's what we did here. Like, it, it came out right on Game Pass. My wife and I just, I think we took a day off or finished all the work earlier. And we played it for a long time. Like, not maybe not 10 hours, but a good part of the day. And tomorrow again, and the next day. And then, you know, we didn't calm down until we, we moved in the meantime. So the first thing we set up here was the PC to finish Psychonauts 2. <laughs> Yeah, just the storyline. But then if you're doing, you know, 100% thing, it's just... Like I said, three hours, just a questionable area. Hey, I collected everything that was in it, but I had a blast. I wasn't bored. It didn't feel like a chore. I enjoyed every second of it. And this is... The, so this is the second time it's easier because there's a lot of things I remember from memory. You don't have to look for that one missing card forever. Do you like... Uh, so? TV Indra, do you also stream? And do you, on top of that, do you like uh, platformer games in general? Or is Psychonauts an outlier? Or is it like story games, like here? This is all, this channel is all about story games. I see Lizzie introduced you to Harold. Oh no, Harry Kasparov here showed up on his own. So why is Lizzie still out there looking for animals? Oh, well, I mostly sent her away well, just because there's too many voices in here. Hint, hint. <laughs> Agent Bull, I need your help. Oh, no. W with what? Hmm, catching them all in Psychonauts. Oh, she's gonna say to that. I need help catching the mole and the psychonauts. Sorry, don't do moles. They're little snuts. Give me the heebie jeebies. No, I mean there's a counter spy in the organization. Oh, well, I'm retired from spy work. A danger to myself and to others, they say. Who would so say? So, how many of them retired? Me. <laughs> um. I need help fighting Maligula. Ah, you need That's to why. a gentleman before slapping him in the face with a name like that. She's long gone, but the scars are still painful. Yeah, they suffered a lot. Hold on. Someone's trying to well, bring let's Maligula ask him that. back. Ah, well, I, I suppose I had enough warning that time. <laughs> Listen, Maligula is dead and gone. Even if she were to return... I was no help fighting her the first time. I'll be sitting out any future molecular battles for everyone's protection. Fair enough, yeah. For everyone's protection. He had to... Never mind. I don't need any help. If you say so. No, no, wait. I had more. I, I just wanted to go back. Huh? That. I wanted to ask him a few things. Do you need help getting out of there? No. I put myself in here. Because he'll explain. Why did you put yourself in there? Well, I was feeling a little overwhelmed. And when I get overwhelmed, accidents happen. Agent Bull? Now I we go there. Help. Oh, no. With what? I was playing a little too much Baldur's Gate over the last few days, so I, <laughs> I'm thinking in that conversation tree now. Like, depending on what you choose, you know, what, what, what's your morality going to be like? I need a senior league membership card. What? Well, well, don't look at mine. Please, Agent Bull. It's important. That bowling card is a precious memento of a dear friend. Oh, I'm sorry. Did she die? No, no, she's somewhere. Out in the forest. What? Well, let's go find her. And just I've like that. I've tried for years, but I just can't. For years. Anymore. Psychonauts is the only game I watch on Twitch. Just a fan. Have a couple games more like nothing specific. All right, fair enough. That's very focused, at least. Unlike some people. <laughs> Psychonauts is a great game to love. Hey, it's an amazing ga game to love. Please let me borrow your senior league membership card. No, now buzz off. 
Buzz off. Hey, hang on a second. Exactly what I was thinking, Harold. The bees could help. Cassie and I always loved working with bees in the forest. If you could bring me just one bee, I'll bet I could talk to it and find out where my Cassie is. No kidding? Here, take this and hurry. Okay, one bee coming up. I came out here looking for something. What was it? Oh, right, a brain for Nick. Okay, I'm off to the forgetful forest to find a bee for Agent Fool. This right. is a serious mission, no matter how adorable it sounds. <laughs> All right, let's go in there. Zoop! Hi! There she is. All right, overly happy lady. What's her name, Liz? Zoop. Hi, Beaver. Bye, Beaver. There we are. Here we are. Hippie's paradise. Questionable area. Oh my God! This this frame rate thing is gonna. I'm just gonna ignore it. Fuck it. Good enough. When I was a kid, I played at 15 frames per second. Never, never ever thought of it as an issue. I'm spoiled now by these new games. You know what? If you want to run at a lower frame rate, be my guest. We need bees. Yeah, loading screens are really good. The goat with the wandering eye always gets me. So, both games, as of a Windows update or something happened. Crazy? I know it's you. I'm not stupid. <laughs> ah crud it's you I thought there's I the blue girl critter <laughs> why are you hunting aren't they feeding you I'm interning with Compton Bull. he sent me out here to catch him some animals I really don't know if you should be bringing animals to agent Bull. his grandson is a friend of mine but that family can be a little bit rough on animals oh and you've never side blasted a squirrel, nature boy? Uh, that's what I thought. Anyway, it's no use. I'd have to go deeper into the forgetful forest for any really good animals. And there's no way I'm going in there. Why? Telekinetic bears? <gasps> Has nobody told you? About the green needle witch who haunts these woods? Her mother was a banshee, and her father was a porcupine <laughs> let me guess she hates children and kills them on sight no she loves children she follows them through the forest and when she catches them she gives them a big hug that doesn't sound so impaling them on her needles filling them with holes okay if you could just let me down now children beware she's there she's there the green needle witch has waited she wants a hug. Don't dare, don't dare, or soon you'll be perforated. <laughs> well, the echo is making it harder. Psychic sense that Lizzie and Norma are sisters. Sibling detection is one of the less celebrated tools in the Psychonauts playbook. The kind they don't get badges for. Oh, it's the music from uh, Whispering Rock. I love this one. Oh, really? Yeah, you can't pet them. You don't have the Beast Mastery pin, that's right. Well, does it count here? Does it change anything? Because I did it by accident. <laughs> Trying to pet them. I I think I blasted a, a goat or burnt it or something like that. And I felt bad. Love? You okay? Okay. Huh? All right, all right. She, I thought she sounded like she needed help. She's just playing a game. Yeah, I was gonna say. I don't know. Well, for some reason, both games after some Windows update or whatever it is, both Psychonauts one and two do this. After a loading a cutscene or just a loading screen, randomly the frame rate will become this. It just becomes jittery. Changing the resolution or. Loading a, you know, entering another loading screen. 
it kind of fixes it, but I don't want to do it every five minutes. I don't know why it started doing that. Okay, I'm just gonna take one of you on a little trip to see an old friend. Swipe. Ooh, I got three. Even better. <laughs> I remember this. Not so fast. Lizzie? I like how he presses on his temples, actually. Like he told his dad. <laughs> Very good effect. Oh, they're in the shape of Cassie. Nope. <laughs> no thanks, bro. <laughs> That's the Green Needle Witch, huh? You just burned them. How is that gonna make them more friendly? Again. Dang it, Pooter. I just got that thing set again. The Green Needle Witch! Where? Th that way! That way! Ugh, you poor city kid. Do yourself a favor and stay indoors where it's safe. Phew! Okay. Better get these bees back to Compton so we can find his friend. And so I can get that Senior League pass. Alright, so give... This is all bowling forward, right? That's right, that's right. All right, all right. So I, I went a little... I went different order, but that's okay. The, the order doesn't matter. Oh, shit, that scared me. I forgot how loud they can be. <laughs> you should replay. And thanks for the follow there, TV and Drug. Appreciate the follow. We're going back to Psycho Isolation. Hi, Beaver. It's Beaver again. Hi! Tara, that's her name. Hi! Tara. It's not Cheryl, it's Tara. <laughs> uh, what was I gonna see? The bees, that's right. A jar of bees. Compton wanted a bee. Guess I over-delivered. Here's some bees. Agent Bull, I got some visitors here who are really excited to. Ah, I said one. I only needed one bee. Shoo, shoo, get out of here. <laughs> Saving his drink. I got extra. They seem friendly. Oh no, don't all talk at once, please. I can't take it. Oh, this I is me can't. in the evenings. It's too, <laughs> much, too much. Oh no, don't explode. And don't explode me. Give Compton the bees. What now? Suit Compton. All right, we got to soothe him. Yep. It's time. Compton isn't handling all these bees very well and certainly won't be handing over that card anytime soon. I should hop in his mind and see if I can help him deal with the chaos of life a little better. Agent Bull? Ah! What's wrong? Too many voices. Too many everything. You want me to kill those bees? No! Of course not. Like with fire, maybe. <laughs> it's totally not a problem. Please, don't hurt them. <laughs> Would you mind if I made a quick and very quiet, uh wellness check inside your mind uh, scream once for yes i may enter your mind you just gotta talk to him all right you don't get to use the door like in the first game Zip. 
Here we go. <laughs> they got crazy levels time. <laughs> Which is why we call this episode Hell's Chicken. Because it's like Hell's Chicken. No, Hell's not Kitchen, yet. but. I'm not ready. Cassie's not here. But it's Compton Bull. Not ready for what? <laughs> Dinner. Uh oh. Let me guess. We're on the menu? No. Worse. Judgment. Judgment? That's right, judges. Court is in session. Please remain standing. If you're able. We gotta grab his hammer, right? Alright, it's battle time. Wait, well, how, what does this do on enemies, I wonder? Oh, I look like... Oh, I look like a robber to him. I, I, I didn't think to do this on, on enemies, really. Let's set up, though. Shooty, fiery, grabby. Those are good. What was the, the deal with him? Oh, I didn't dodge in time. Woohoo! Uh, the, the, oh, you can burn his hammer, that's right. I think you can also grab it. Oh. Never touch a judge's gavel. oh shit, I should have thrown it. Just throw the gavel at him, that's right. Let's take a five-minute recess. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's right, the gavel. Captain, anything but this. It's time for Form Crawler. <laughs> Ram it down. It's yeah, I it's crazy, I remember that much. It's yeah. Good evening. Tin and Can Zanato. I'm your host, Tin Can Zanato. I love how they use their real we'll voices. Watch one lucky contestant prepare three increasingly complicated dishes in an attempt to please our celebrity judges. Tim. Possible. He'll never do it. He's nothing. Well, that's foresight. <laughs> <laughs> and he's the nice one. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I remember and the fruits. Our first dish, a tragic delicacy from a troubled nation, a Grulovian drowned egg. Ooh. First, our contestant will have to find a very outspoken egg. Ooh, me. Boil it in hot water. I'm all fired up and ready to go. Prepare it with an unruly onion. It said my name! Unruly? It's been sliced into pieces. Just call me Pork Stopper. Put them both together on a plate and see if the judges can bear two. Ram it down! Finish your dish before the clock runs out. And you'll win valuable prizes from the mystery box. Well, I think one of these is missable, isn't it? What do you say? Think you're up to the challenge? Yeah. <laughs> Sounds easy. We got this. Right, partner? Partner? Yeah. What was I expecting? Oh yeah, we got time. So what did he say I have to do? I already forgot it. I was I'm having a wonderful time here. Compton Bull seems to be a little overwhelmed and edgy. I'm not sure I trust his judgment in this state. Maybe I'll have a look around his brain to see what's cooking. What's cooking? So I'm not gonna like unlike usual prepare a drowned egg. Pounded big red button to reveal the meal. Alright. So 
unlike the first, unlike usual, where we... I, I need the egg, right? 100% to level right away. This one. Oh, we got 10 minutes, actually. Wait for the steam. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, wait. To the left, come on. Never boils. Is there anything else to do? Well, don't just sit there resting on your boils. We've got other ingredients to That's prepare. right. They need chopped uh, onion. Was it? I, I think, think I will. Here's... Ah, here's the What's the next thing? Uh, while the egg's cooking, I need an onion. 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 There he is. Are you an onion? What's that sound? What do we need to do with you it? You won't be sorry. Let's see if he makes the cut. Oh, I already Let's forgot. Up, I dare you. Oh, let me see. Alrighty, alrighty. Thanks for dropping by, Twindra. Good luck. Wait, it says onion. Chopping, chopping, chopping. There Don't it is. Listen to those goats. They're all liars. You can't have it overcooked. And the other one's for the egg, right? Oh, we need the onion chopped first. That's right. Stupid goats. Here. There. Pool. All right, I gotta, I gotta really listen on this one. Oh, the eggs cook. All right. Quick, hit that button. Process has begun. Grab it, I guess. Oh, you can, you don't have to hold the button. I feel like this is the real me. Let's play that chef. Can you do? Oh, you can combine powers. That really helps. Alright, let's go get that egg. <coughs> the egg was... Where was the cook? <coughs> Grab the egg, which is deliciously cooked. We make a great team. Let's see if he can get it to the plate. Why not? We'll collect the shit later. Just put it on, I guess. He's assembled all his ingredients. If Chef would just hit that button, we can begin the presentation. Did we make it? I I'm not sure. We'll find out. I suppose. Well, there he is. Oops. I'm a bee. I love cooking, but I hate cooking. <laughs> <laughs> My man, that's exactly how I feel about it. Come on, Agent Paul. Let's do this together. Without Cassie, our goose is cooked and probably cooked incorrectly. <gasps> Guess I'll have to do it myself. Bong. Well, here we are. At the moment of truth. Will we be looking at a drowned egg or a drowned contestant? Look, why not both? Reveal the meal. <laughs> oh. <coughs> Man, it looks pretty good. I want that now. Sir, what we did was we took an egg. Boring. And we they were gonna it into the water. The way it's gonna. Uh, then, uh, then Chef had the idea to uh, withhold the salt at just the right moment to create a sense of uh, longing within the yolk, if you will. You what? We think it really improves the nose feel of the composition. Hmm, compelling. 
Surprisingly acceptable. And that's not all. By finishing within the time limit, you've opened the mystery box. Half a mind. There you go. Well, don't just stand there resting on your laurels. That one was a gimme. Let's see how you do on your next dish. Shoo! Congratulations! You did it! How does it feel? Is this Truman or Bob? It's supposed to be Truman. Well, uh, get ready. Truman's among us and all For your next dish, right after this commercial message. <laughs> Tin can crunch. Wait, really? There's a message. Oh, yeah, there's an ad. <laughs> With sensors and all. Oh yeah, I don't belong here. No. Oops. Wait. Yeah, I always gotta remember what's the lock-in button in the second game. No. Oh yeah, they should take more damage. Did they put that pin on? Mental magnet. Speed reader. <clears throat> I don't need that right now. <clears throat> what I do need is this. Alright, I'll be ready next time. That's right, alright. Oh shit. Ow! Where's the fire? I'm being attacked in, in the, during the ad break. <laughs> Zip. Need more fire. Did they get that pin though for fire? That's pyrokinesis. No, I did not. Oh shit, I couldn't. Council must not badger the gavel. Come on. Oh, I thought I would get a cheap shot on him. Can I grab a book he's throwing? Let's try that, actually. Oh, no. Never touch a judge's gavel. Where's the gavel? You may cross-examine counselor. Agent Bull, an important thing to do when you're feeling overwhelmed is to take breaks. So before I push that button and start the next dish, let's take a breather, okay? Good idea. Right, let's take a break and collect everything we can. Oh, we got a full half of mine. More health, there you go. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. You do hear some emotional baggage. First tag. Let's go. Let's check all the tools at once. Let's go in tools. Yep. First here. What's that sound? Oh yeah, they they do uh, they do replenish. Like they the new ones pop in the place of the old ones. So something to keep an eye on. And we need the dark thoughts here. I need six ranks. Hmm. Go back. How do I get that one? Oh, I know. I get it. I get it. You gotta do this. Like that. There you go. That's how. Yes, got the 
Got the tag now. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. Yeah, I think so too. The way ah ha ha ha! I think I know. Because it's a dark thought, okay. I see more of them there, so that's we need six points for that. Six level points. Whee! What is that? Can we burn it? Nope. Oh, but it hurts when you touch it, okay? How about, wait, what if I shoot at it? What if I block it? Levitation, maybe? Nope, still hurts. Ah, that sucks. Ooh, the flying Ginsu knives. Better go up, huh? Oh, oh that's okay. I got him. Oh, a memory vault. Hi. All right, we got Compton on his own. It's Compton and Cassie. Compton Sanctuary. And that... Huh, that's familiar over there in the background. Left in the background. They were fighting Maligula with bears and wolves and whatnot. Oh, the whole forest, because he can control animals, that's right. And then uh, there was, oh, she drowned them all. Oh my god, it's horrible. Yep, I remember now. There's Why does Ford Crawler look like a doofus on every... On every... drawing in these games and then there's helmut full bear's funeral you can see the guitar the flowers and all that and they're opening the mother lobe and everyone's gloom except for auto mentalis that's what raz commented on in the panel of fame or whatever they call it in the main area so this is Whispering Rock, is it? Is this happening or is it? does it have anything to do with Whisp Whispering Rock, the funeral? Kind of looks Whispering Rockish. There is, there is some rock and roll there. That's why everyone was so glum. Well, why is Otto so happy? He does, did he even care? I forgot about that. And there's Compton on his own. So Cassie, Cassie's there. Look, there's four of them, five. So there was... The Psychic Seven, right? So, Helmut and minus Helmut and Mal minus Maligula. And there you get uh, Lucretia Mux. I mean, there's Compton. Bowling is all he has. He saw Cassie go into the forest. And all the animal and human voices, all of them started overwhelming him. So she was keeping him stable, kind of. This is like Ninja Warrior, but with food. Now with food. Now with nutritious food. I think I hear something. You do, Raz. I need a steamer trunk tag for this guy. Alright, so we don't have that. We know where it is though. There's more. Just don't step on the Maybe hot it's ones. Time to smash that button and get cooking again. There we go. The purse is gonna be fine. <laughs> That's one happy purse.
Oh. Alright, they're all cool. I fell on my head. That's... I saved it. No. Ah, where's my magnet thingy? Did I buy a magnet? Oh, mental magnet. Well, how does it work? It doesn't feel that way yet. Ow, 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 shit. How did I fuck that up? Ow, ow. Multiple ow. Wait, you're serious? Anything behind? If I look from behind here, nothing. We're really Ayata. There it is. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Come on, Froggy. Isn't the suitcase... Wait, the suitcase. That's the thing I've seen. No, that's the steamer trunk, I think. What did you call it? I would call that thing the suitcase. Some emotional baggage. I need steamer steamer trunk, yep. I don't know English names for. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 oh. I don't think that's designed to go that way. Ow. Alright, almost dead. Now it's time to find some help. I managed to. I managed to dry all the health out with that. I guess I've seen some... Shit. Where did I see them? Well, what's the worst that can happen when you die? You just get reset one. There they are. Alright. I know I left some health around. For this exact reason. There you go. He hears what? Didn't I see more of them? <gasps> how, 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 how unlucky would that be? <laughs> You know you're right, Raz, but no. There they are. I know I left them somewhere. I just hope they don't fall behind me. There you go. Alright, saved. Oh, pretty doopity boop. Oh, wait. Alright, let's try it this way. Hoppity boopity boop. Thank you. Cauliflower? Anything else? Oh, look, there's something all the way up there. <clears throat> Which, how the fuck do you even get up there? There's the cooking part. There's more health here. Alright, full health. More colorful. Sausage. La sausage. Well, that's a nugget of wisdom. I would have never guessed that, honestly. Well, wasn't there one more up there? Yeah, there's... Wait, where did they see that? All the way up there, see? How the fuck do I get there? 
I guess we'll have to guess. Well, there's one more ride over there. Whee! We can destroy the cameras. That's right. Why can we go low here? Wasn't there... I'm pretty sure more figments appear after different parts of the stage are done. That's how I have it in memory. Crazy stage, isn't it? There it is, up there. How do I... How would I even get up there? Yeah, that's a nugget of wisdom. I think it's got something to do with dark thoughts? I think it does, actually. Definitely something from behind. What's that sound? Yeah, pretty sure it's got something to do with dark thoughts. So I'm gonna leave that one as well. It tells us it's in here, doesn't it? Yeah. Nuggets of Wisdom, Half of Minds, yep, there you go. Nugget of Wisdom here is a whisking thingy. Oh, figments are almost done. That can be right, I'm pretty sure they'll introduce more. Where's the one I didn't go down? Oh, there's one over there, and one over there, alright. No, 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 no! Oh, there's a vault. I see a vault. Let's go there first. At the chopster. I was only trying to help. Is that young Compton? He snuck in the animal? Safe house? He let them all go. Oh, okay. They all loved him? Is that him? He snapped. Wait, no? Oh, he burnt them all. Oh, boy. Oh, he ended up in prison? He killed them all. And then Ford came to rescue him, to bail him out. Damn, forgot that. I forgot that. dark stuff like with this cool music going you know but in being you know in the background their minds are dark there it is that's two out of two out of five we got two more tags all right we got the cat box and the other tag and the other Cause I don't know how what it's called. Every fucking bag. There's the there's one. Huh. That's the headbox, right? Is there anything over there behind? I feel like I'm gonna get hurt for nothing, but you know, I could be completely shit. You think I was doing this for something, but there is nothing there. At least it returns all the health it stole from you. Yeah, yeah, we'll punch it. Don't worry. Don't you worry, game. Oh, there's one there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The last toboggan was here, or like, slide. Well, that's about it. Kind of reminds you of Glorious Theater, you know? 39 or 51, that's, yeah, very few left. Alright, let's do the other parts. We've dicked around long enough. Gonna need the plucking, that's right. Pachapa! See Agent Pool? 
You can do it. Next one won't be so easy. You got that right. For your next dish, <laughs> you'll be creating a strawberry jam croque madame. Ooh, yeah. Croak madame. You'll need to boil another egg. Boil egg. <laughs> Easy. Take some bread. I've already risen to the occasion. Slice it up. Bread's much nicer once it's been through the slicing. And fry it up on the griddle. All right. I'm getting ready to rip it. Flip out. Uh, what about strawberry? Huh? Hey. <laughs> Glad you asked. We'll need not just any strawberry. But a strawberry that's been blended. Did someone call for patty puree? <laughs> All right, monsieur. It's time to show us your best madame. I wonder which ingredient he'll select first. Well, egg egg takes time to cook, so hey, let's start with that. Works with my brother. I feel good about this. For your brother? Walk in the kitchen, please. Especially with that. Auto aim would always already bring it to him. <laughs> I can't wait to get cooked. <laughs> Crazy vegetables. Alright, we need a strawberry. Fresh and smart and just a little tart, right here. Alright, uh, you wanna you go for it? We need a blended strawberry, right? Wait, where's the blender? I am so sweet. So unbelievably sweet. Yes, you are. Just show me the blender. Oh, there's the blender. Oh my god, this part. You know, I don't know why, but I just can't wait to be blended. He sounds like ass dirty. I don't know why, but he sounds like ass dirty. Careful. I lost an arm in there once. Once it could taste human flesh. Well, it changes the relationship. Trust me. Can I use this while carrying him? Whoop. Oh yeah, you can. Right, blending while it's cooking, right? Wait, I just throw it in, right? So blend me already. Uh, I'm not getting any smoother just hanging around. Oh, there you go. What could possibly go wrong? While it's blending, don't fall. Oh, I gotta press the button. Oh shit, alright. Alright, egg. It's five minutes, I'll do it. Well, that's working. It's magic. We only have five more seconds? Oh, oh sorry, I have it. Grab the egg. Go right. Whoop. Deliver the egg. Whoop. Where's the egg? Egg goes here. Alright, let's go get that bread toasted. Maybe if I post them. And we need to slice it up, right? Oh, you gotta do it multiple times. Is it chopped? Uh. Oh, it needs to be in the pan, okay? Yeah, there it is. <clears throat> no, no. I need the. Uh... No, no, no. That's okay. Jump. Gotta get to the skillet. <laughs> I got three minutes. All right. <clears throat> All right. Um, don't fail me now. <laughs> Gotta move it as they move. <clears throat> Just a 
No, it's already done. Good. All right, we got the bread. We're gonna get the strawberry. Everything in time. <clears throat> smells good. Actually, what do you mean? Actually, I did all this. Blended strawberry. Where is this blender? There it is. Wish she were here. Gotta go up to do that, huh? Wait, where's the strawberry? What did I miss? Where's the where's the strawberry? Well, it's got to be somewhere around here. I just blended it. Oh, there it is. That's the... I thought it was the enemy. <laughs> Damn, Strawberry. I thought you were in, you were one of those purple things. He's done it. All the ingredients are in. As soon as Chef hits that button, we'll serve the judges. Did we make it? I... I'm not sure. We'll find out, I suppose. Croak, 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 croak. Croak. <laughs> what do you think, Chef? Did you get caught in a jam? Are you worried about croaking? Reveal the meal. Ooh. What do you have to say for yourself? We have uh, attempted to infuse this dish with... Uh... Curiosity and resilience. The more sensitive palates among you will also discern just a dash of regret. <laughs> <laughs> Slightly better than a mouthful of nails. Slightly better than a mouthful of nails. You heard him, folks. That means they like it. Not all. By finishing within the time limit, you've opened the mystery box. Good. Now be gone and bring us more food. Well, you two must be feeling great after producing such a quality product for our judges. And speaking of quality products, it's time for a word from one of our sponsors. How the stock audience sounds. Bees? Eat it. Oh, they're regrets. Part of a complete... What? It's not breakfast. What, what am I doing on set every time? Raz, you're, you made this for yourself, man. Pew! Pew! Fucking regrets. Oh, no, it's the dude. Oof. Well, I should have set him on the fire first. Is that so? Oh! Oh, I didn't grab it. Alright, next time try to grab it when he does that. Is it burning? I thought I could... Yeah, I can't set him on fire, alright. No, can't grab him. Alright, at least I know. Good. Council must not badger the gavel! The judge must not cheat. This is a court of law. A court of law. <laughs> I am the law. Thank you for helping me, young man. 
Ratno, what I do without you? How would you feel about taking a little break before I push that button to start the next dish? That's just what the doctor ordered. All right, let's take this half a mind. Good. All right, any new, any new figments that form, they're gonna be around. There they are. The butter one, so the toboggan again. All right, let me go one by one. That does it become? It's still fifty nine. All right, so that's. 12 left to find okay I see so uh, yeah after each round new ones will spawn so this is a pretty easy this is a basically a short level Ow! just takes so long because we're enjoying it Bloop. this is a mini level by all yep. Psychonauts right 2 standards Oh, it's a little oozy here. What's the ooze supposed to represent? Like cooking grease or something? There's the Dark Thought. How many levels do I have? I need six. One more. Alright, if we can get one more level, we can get to that Dark Thought right away. One more rank left for that. Where do I want to go first? Let's do the whole round. Whoop. Right. Then forward. Then right. Then right. Then straight. So nothing new there. Zoop. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. Why is he saying that here? Is there one of them? Oh look, there's look where the figment is. Like I said. They'll be where you weren't before. There's the more baggage. <laughs> so easily missable. <laughs> so that's the suitcase, right? Yep, tagged suitcase. Try not to touch it. Whoop. Woohoo! That was close. Come on, I'll need a little more to level up. Whoop, 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 whoop. They're down there as well, right? I can get the one from another, somewhere else. We don't have the suitcase tag yet, do we? Nope. Uh, the steamer trunk tag, I mean. There's one toboggan. Oh, slide. Whee! Yippee! Not here. Oh, you can use the... Anything on this side? No. Oh, there's... look. I knew there was gonna be something there later. See, that's weird with memory. You remember it was there. Not exactly when it was there, but just it was there. Anything up here? Not yet, Raz, but there's only a few left. There, there's a few. Is it the last two? Tell me it's the last two. No. Three left, and I see two of them. <laughs> no, 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 wrong button. Why did I press the wrong? Why do I do that? Well, there's a good question for myself. Why do you do that, me? That's how you go up there. It gives you clues. Hi, Piggy. Okay, one, one figment left. We're back to the old Psychonauts. 
thing with one figment left. Can go up there. But I should be able to go up there, no problem. No, no, no. Well, goodbye, cool world. There's no saving from this one. Ah! Oh, it just returned me there. It's mighty kind of you, dude. Alright. One of them. Yeah, all the way there. Whew. It's hard to tell. <laughs> Let's keep it kind of to the side. It's hard to tell. Uh... God, look at that. Oof, 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 oof. And goodbye. Alright, at least. I don't think. Do I lose anything? You don't lose anything. Oh, you lose a quarter of one health point. Alright, I can live with that. Nice. I think Dark Thought was supposed to bring me there, but... And I see the last figment, the Dark Thought upgrade, there you go. No! Ah! I don't think that will help. I wanted to... <laughs> I tried to make a save. <gasps> it does! It does count! Very nice of you, game. Oop. And exactly what we need! Isn't that lovely? Oh, that's beautiful. All right, Dark Thoughts, here I come. There it is. That's the Dark Thought. It's hard to see. See it there? <laughs> and the last figment. I've collected literally everything except for for that one tag. I thought I saw it there. I like the white. But if I'm gonna help you, I'd better hit that button and start the next dish. Yeah, dark thoughts. There well you need uh you need the upgrade, you need the final uh, mental connection upgrade. Connect to Dark Thoughts to reach Privet. It's for 100% thing. Like, if you're speedrunning, you're probably not even gonna see it. I'm missing the Steamer Trunk tag, though. I don't know where that is. Well, we're almost done here anyway, so we got all the... Wasn't even trying. <laughs> With all the figments, nuggets. So, yeah, only the Steamer Trunk tag. I think that Steamer Trunk tag is in the final mystery box. If you do it in... So if you do it all and within the time limit, it'll open right away. If you don't, once you go back, uh, once you go back through what is it called, the common consciousness, the collective consciousness, it'll be just open. So it just rewards you get it, getting stuff earlier. Oh, I hope I didn't just jinx it. Me too, because it's time for our third and. Final dish, straight from the Lumber Stack Diner, it's the Honey Pepper Pancake Stacker. You'll need another egg. Ooh. We're old friends. He boiled my dad and grandfather. <laughs> oh, that egg needs to fry. Then I'm your guy. Fry egg, okay. Next, you'll need a boar. I'm just a pig, but trust me, I'm game. Get it? Whatever, as long as that pig gets sliced. That's a little sick, man. <laughs> so frying both the pork and pig stack, that signature beehive look, you're going to be using an actual beehive. Wait, really? I wish Cassie were here to handle those. Well, I'm here. Don't worry. But wait, there's more. The final touch of summery sweetness comes from a watermelon. It's about time. That's been chopped. Sure, Ooh. I guess. Uh, kind of still thinking about that pig, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Looks like I'm the big finish. No pressure, but this is Ford Cruller's favorite dish. 
To mess this up would be an insult to the very heart of the Psychonauts. Yeah. So he's pretty insecure about his so colleagues. Better get cooking. All right, five minutes. Start with the egg. We don't fuck around this time. <laughs> you crazy fry fucking egg. egg shell. Oh, we gotta fry it. Never mind. I'll get there. It's force of habit. Forgive me. Left. There we go. So we need to fry, that's right. You can see which it's gonna be. It starts letting off gas just before. A little too early, but okay. What do you mean? It's in the same place. Are you making jokes in this serious program, sir? So fry an egg. Wait, where's the egg? There we go. Fry an egg. Chop the pig with a pig chopper. Huh? No time. This is weird. Petey? Is that you? Oh no. This just not weird. This is all I ever wanted, Grandpa. I'm so glad he's you doing the chopping. Mm. That's so fucked up. So chop the pig and then fry it, all right. <laughs> Let's fry it. Woo. No. Okay. Mm. Is that honey pepper boar bacon I smell? Watch the gas. That looks ready to serve. Oh really? Already? Man, I'm good at this cooking stuff when it's inside people's heads. <laughs> Alright, and then finally, that's only half the time, so we'll make it. So that's fried pig. Then need fucking honeybees. No, not you. Oh, we gotta boil them, alright. That'll be good. While they're boiling, we can do other stuff. Maybe I should have started boiling first, because that's does on its own, but oh, I can feel it helping my lower back already. <laughs> oh. You know, this game will always be a feel good. Watermelon, watermelon. Hi watermelon. We gotta chop and then the rest of the for the melon to be sliced. Let's see if Chef remembers. Of course I remember, I was just there. Oh. Did they just laugh because I got hurt? Ingredient in position. Now we must quickly grab the pork chopper's hook. Get out of there, kids. Those blades are sharp. Stop it. Quick, hit that button, Chef. Alright, and then the blender, which is all the way there. What? Imagine fucking it up with that. One minute left, we can do it, come on. That watermelon is still a little chunky. Better oh shit. The yeah. bees are cooked. Looks ready. Now, he just has to get it back to the serving plate. All right, 40 seconds. Can we do it? Thirty seconds. Whoop. Where's the bee go? That's over there. Twenty-nine seconds. I don't want to panic. Get moving. Oh, I'm not gonna make. I should have put this to blend first. Ah. Oh. oh, that's sad. That takes time. 
Okay, we'll get the we'll get the steamer trunk when we come back from collective unconscious. Five seconds. I should have put it the blend for it. that. That was just a no-brainer. Things that take time that can do work on their own. You do while you know. So this takes forever. I should have done that first, and then frying is an action you gotta do yourself. So. Well, everything else needs to be done on its own. Could have made it. Yeah, yeah, you can just... <laughs> you can just do it from the starting point, that's right. That's it, right? Whoop. What? What did we say? Come on, Compton. I need help. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Let's see. Lumber stack. Lumber stack. Lumber stack. Have I mentioned that when Lumber prepared stack. improperly, Lumber the honey stack. pepper pancake stack stack. can produce an Lumber interesting stack. byproduct? Lumber no, stack. I didn't Lumber mention stack. the possibility of a Lumber deadly stack. swarm of Lumber killer stack. bees. Ah, no matter. Lumber stack. Let's see what we got. Reveal. <laughs> Everybody's gonna live, don't worry. Maybe. Is that the tallest stack you could manage? It's taller than it looks. Because we put the literal height of the horizontality of the flavor profile, if you will. Uh, he's he's bullshitting now as well. <laughs> Moderately pleasant. Moderately pleasant. <laughs> well, Chef, it looks like you've won over not just our judges, but also our audience. How do you feel? I, uh, well, I, I, I couldn't have done it without this young man here. No way! You can totally do this on your own now, Agent Bull. No, don't say that. That's great to hear. Because it's time for what, audience? Double down! No! That's right. It's time to... Aha, boss time. Chef will be cooking alone in our isolation station. Completely dependent on his sous chef to gather the ingredients he needs for the final three dishes. Don't worry, Agent Pool. I'll get you all I remember this. It's what do you think, judges? Fucked up. Ready for another course? No problem. We're professional. Uh, we might have to make a little room. Okay, first dish is vegetable medley. Ingredients on the board. I'm getting out of here before things get messy. Here we go. Gluttonous ghosts, possibly overserved. I should touch that. I don't Well, it's about time you found one of them. Is there what we need onion? Is this an onion? I uh -huh. Oh wait, you need egg. You need a specific thing, alright. Oof, 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 oof. Oh, that went bad. Oh. Oh god, it's disgusting. <laughs> oh god. Oh god, that's... I don't suppose one of those goats recently regurgitated a straw. Oh, I hate to see that. I'm going to close my eyes. <laughs> Keep an eye on the help. I don't like it in here. 
They all puke differently. <laughs> Need strawberry, yeah, there you go. Now I just have to make this dish all by myself. Oof. Oof, oof, oof. Oh shit, I gotta turn them on fire. Ah! Where's the fire? I don't have fire on. Fire needs to see the. All right, I need help, though. I. As you know, in the double down round, the chef's assistant must serve the dish to the judges. Let's see if this young man has a passion for service. How? Oh, grab it. Oh, why? All right, here we go. Judges are so I'm gonna have to serve them myself. Oh, just press Y, all right. Oh, literally feed them, yep. Oh, auto metallic. Our judge liked that dish, perhaps a little too much. Oh, but it looks like someone's ready to get back in the mix. That's gonna be messy. Yeah. I'm out of here. Second dish is Royal Borscht. Good luck. So what now? Quickly, so bread. No bread. Excellent. I need a pig now. Oh shit. Oh, whoa, whoa, he's fast. You can do this, Compton. Just clear your mind. Oh, please tell me this batch has no ingredient in here. I got a side pop, do I? Oh, help, help, help. I want the help. Always keep fixing it. Potato. No, not what I need. Pig. There you go. Full health, alright. He needs eggs. One of those disgusting ones might hold the key to our victory. Why is he picking up the wrong ingredient? Well, because he can't see what they are, commentator guy. There we go. Alright. Dodge for the love of shit. Jesus Christ, so many. Good thing I took sensory overload. Whoop. Phew. All right, here we go. Yeah, it's like when you're focused on everything, it's hard to notice anything. Serve it before it gets up and walks away. What? How? Oh, just why? There we go. Whoop! All right. Let's see if our second judge can exercise a little more moderation. The animation is just stellar. Someone's been overserved. Oh, it gets really like bloody. <laughs> but our final dish is no laughing matter. Mess up these jam tarts, and you'll find yourself in a sticky situation. Yeah. 
Just ignore and get to the health. What do we need? We need bees. We don't need one of those right now. Oh, that's not going to help the chef's final step. Put that down. You'll spoil the dish. Where, where, where? There we go. He's got a good one. Relative. Oh, yes. It's gotta be a somewhere. The music is kick ass, really. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Oh, they're, they're just making a lot of mess. The ingredients right. are so nice. Oh, it's gonna throw them back to me. Oh, you. Your bread. No, oh, fuck. Why did they say bread? I need the watermelon. Oh, God. I had it. I don't want that. I know, I know. I fucked up. I wouldn't either. Please be a watermelon. Fuck, I had it. Man, where's the watermelon? I, I threw it somewhere. Oh, I gotta wait for another puke episode. There we go. Need the watermelon. It's gotta be the last one. That's better. Oh, that's great. Wait, I need a strawberry. This dish. A strawberry. All right, next is strawberry. That can't be good. Jeff seems to be holding it together in the isolation. Hmm. Are you just gonna throw some puke at me? Oh, there you go. This is horrible to watch in so many ways. <laughs> I agree. I agree, dear commentator Zanato. Oh, please tell me this batch has the ingredient we need. Oh, every batch has the ingredients we need. Why are you playing with that? I don't want that. Strawberry, you gotta be a strawberry. Why is he picking up the wrong ingredient, I wonder. I like how they say that as if you can choose. Oosh. I, I don't want to chase it, but I feel like this one will be my best one yet. Get in, in a Oh shit, I forgot they can shoot. <laughs> you dead? Alright, one more guy left. All right, you got your hammer, boy. It's on fire. He dead. Here we go. Alright, crawl. Quickly, young man. You never know what these tongues might do. Smash, 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 smash the button. That's it. <laughs> GG. This is like, this seems very Monty Python inspired. But they, they've had a few Monty Python-ish jokes. I like how through all of this, the kitty has been lying here. She hasn't moved. Aha! Uh -huh. 
So he's been controlling them all along. Well, I don't know about you, but I've certainly had my fill of excitement today. All right, everybody, let's clean up this mess. <laughs> Come on, get a move on. Clean kitchen, clean mind. Ah, uh, you see, this is why I usually get takeout. <laughs> Wee. He's already better. But what do you mean they won't let her out? What librarian? Yeah, it's hmm. wonderful, isn't it? As in, that's how humans yeah, work. Boy, you've earned this. Somebody has cooking. Somebody has find Cassie right away. Something else. Lost. We'll never get lost. I know that forest like the back of my So this uh, you know the Wait, one thing Don't you want help? <laughs> yes, he does. Yes, he doesn't. Another rank. Nice. And we got the senior league membership card. With Compton's bowling card, I have full access to the Astro Lane's bowling alley. You know, I as much as I love is I love this game. It's it, it serves the story, but it's kind of ridiculous. Almighty Psychonauts, that's a lot of quests. Almighty Psychonauts were stuck there for years until this little kid. Yeah, we know why uh, by the end, but you know, <laughs> until he came and solved their mental issues, they couldn't do it for each other. But like I said, it'll make it'll make a lot of sense at the end for those who haven't played the game. Oh, what the psycho isolation chamber is done. Pass, I can get to Agent Crawler in the bowling alley and try to reconnect that aspect of his mind. The bowling aspect. True that. Well, this is where we're gonna stop for today, folks. That's enough for today. Tomorrow we're continuing and finishing. <laughs> I'm not going to say 100% because that never pays off, but let's say about 95% definitely finishing uh, <laughs> uh, a way out as Couch Wednesdays. And we're continuing Psychonauts on Thursdays. So Tuesdays and Thursdays, Psychonauts too, for now. You too, Tivindra. Thank you for dropping by. Thank you for chatting about Psychonauts. Always, always a joy. And uh, you have a beautiful rest of your day as well sash we'll do it hello beautiful we'll 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 do it. look i'm enjoying this so much it's taking definitely more time than i wanted i'm i i really gotta i really gotta get to mayo's and and sega fans game <laughs> let's see who we can let's see who we can raid is someone streaming what is it today tuesday it was christmas here the last two days i lost my touch with time Not touch. Are they, yeah, it is kind of. Let's see something that connects well. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Popcorn cannon explains something retro. What is this? It's it's Ninja Gaiden. You know what? I like that as a as a as a segue. I think nin Ninja Gaiden is good. The first Ninja Gaiden is a great segue. Plus, we haven't raided popcorn in a while. Here you go. Popcorn cannon go. It's not Friday the 13th. <laughs> Here we go. The raid is successful in first try. Wow, Twitch. New year, new tools, new stability, I guess. Except I can't pay for my subscriptions. We'll talk about that. So like I said, everything I said stands. Thanks for watching again, everyone. You're a lovely audience. And uh, say hi to Popcorn Cannon there. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.